Today we're comparing the new Kinetrex Slide Rocks to their original Hard Scrabble. Just a reminder guys, head on over to Mike'sArchery.com to pick up any of our latest logo gear. We got plenty of hats and shirts as well as any gear you might need for your next adventure. Welcome back to Mike's Archery and we are taking a look at a brand new boot from Kinetrek and that's the new Slide Rocks. So we wanted to make some comparisons between that boot and what we felt was a comparison that they've had for the last several years in their Hard Scrabble Hiker. So we pulled out uh, a brand new pair of Slide Rocks. We just got them in here not too long ago. Uh, we haven't had a lot of time to wear them, but some of the guys around the shop have been trying them out, wearing them at home and just in the woods here in turkey season, just to kind of get a feel and a comparison between what these new slide rocks uh, feel and how they work versus the original hard scrabbles that we've been used to for the last several years. So right off the bat, the boots look somewhat similar. Uh, obviously both a seven inch tall hiker type boot, all leather uppers. Now one of the things we did notice right off the bat the hard scrabbles have got a single piece leather uh, upper while it is a multi-layered, multi-piece leather top here on the new slide rocks. They both got great ankle support, definitely got a little more padding what we're seeing in the slide rocks. It's a, a little more comfort padding in there. It's thicker in the tongue, uh, thicker around the ankle. Uh, it's more of a straight leather padding in the hard scrabble. So you may have a little better feel around your ankle in these new slide rocks. They both have a full tongue, top to bottom. Again, multi-piece leather in there versus the one-piece construction on the hard scrabble. Now, as far as the sole, that was one of the things that intrigued us about this new boot. And when we got those in, we, we really wanted to see what the difference was. It was kind of one of the main selling points between the slide rock and the hard scrabble. Uh, it's a little softer sole, so it's only a five millimeter midsole of nylon in there makes it a little more flexible. It's still a fairly stiff boot, probably more stiff than what you're gonna see uh, in your standard hiking boot or what you're gonna see in like a Danner or something like that. Uh, it's still a stiffer boot than that, somewhat of a mountaineering, backpacking, hiking style boot, but it's only five millimeters versus the seven millimeter uh, in the hard scrabble. And if you've ever worn a Kinetrek uh, on their mountaineering side, whether it be a hard scrabble or even their mountain extremes, uh, they are a very stiff soled boot. Uh, now, like we said, this is going to be a little softer boot, got a little more flex to it. And then the other thing we uh, wanted to see was this new rubber sole. So it is a reinforced rubber sole. It's definitely a softer rubber than what we're seeing out of that K Talon sole that comes on the hard scrabble. One of the things that they had advertised and we were hoping to see is if you've ever worn a pair of Kinetrek hard scrabbles or the Mountain Extremes, uh, if you get on wet concrete or something to that effect, a hardwood floor, walking back in the house or something, uh, they are slick. Uh, they will get away from you real quick if you're not ready for it. Uh, it seems to be what we've seen out of this new slide rock, definitely a more rubbery sole, definitely a little more traction, a little more grip there uh, in those slicker situations, which was what we wanted to see as an everyday boot or an everyday hiker, not necessarily uh, you know, you're backpacking extreme going in for a few days or, or getting to the top of the mountain. These are going to be a little softer sole, a little more grippy in that rubber. That was one of the main differences that we saw in these two boots. Now from there, you do have a reinforced rubber toe and heel on the new slide rocks. So it's, it's more of a textured rubber uh, versus the hard scrabble having that full rubber all the way around. Definitely gives you more protection. Uh, from rocks, shale, sharp uh, stuff in the woods. These are still gonna be a great boot, lots of protection there, but you're missing that in the center. It's just not built as rugged as the hard scrabble. Now, as we've been wearing them around, testing them out, one of the guys had noticed it seems to be a little bigger toe box uh, in the slide rocks. If you got a little wider toe, these slide rocks may fit for you a little better than what a hard scrabble does. I don't think it's an extreme uh, amount, like an extra wide or anything like that but it definitely seems to have a little wider toe box than the original Hard Scrabble did. Now they both have the Wintex waterproof and breathable membrane in there. Kinetrek does not use Gore-Tex, but we somewhat compare it to that. It's again, it's a windproof, waterproof, uh, flexible and breathable membrane that's built into these boots, keeps your feet dry, keeps everything moving and grooving so you don't have to worry about uh, getting wet feet while it's raining or crossing creeks and things of that nature. Now when we were looking just a basic look of these boots as far as uh, function and things. 
The laces on a hard scrabble are definitely a little tougher boot lace. I think you'll get a little longer uh, lifespan out of a hard scrabble boot lace than you will out of these new slide rocks. It just seems to be a little lesser material there. And the other thing we noticed about it as well is the slide rocks have a fixed eyelet. Now you're still getting a full toe to top tightening there with your laces. However, it is a fixed eyelet here. So on your hard scrabble, these eyelets will pivot and move. It's just a little more rugged boot for what it's made for, where the slide rock is just gonna have those fixed non-pivoting laces. Now we assume that Kinetrek took the weight of these boots based on a size 10. That's kind of where the baseline is for taking the weights of boots. They are advertising these new slide rocks as a lightweight boot at 3.6 pounds for the pair. Now a hard scrabble actually comes in advertised at 3.5, so actually a little bit lighter than even these new slide rocks are. And when we threw them on the scale, we just wanted to see where they fell at. Um, the slide rocks actually weighed 3.7, we'll call it close enough, and the hard scrabbles came in at 3.5 right on spec weight. Now from there, these boots are not made in the same place. If you're familiar with Kinetrek, their stuff is made in Europe. It's high grade, really nice stuff. And so the hard scrabbles are still being made in Italy while these new slide rocks are coming out of Romania. Still a European boot, but we do feel that Italy has a little better craftsmanship in boots and high-end footwear uh, than Romania. And I'm sure that's why you're seeing these boots come out a little different place. Now, when we looked at the leather grain on them, it seems to be a little better grade leather also on the hard scrabble than it is on the slide rock. But overall, a really nice quality boot here. Uh, we're intrigued by the soles. Like I said, if you're not a big fan of those really stiff soles uh, and also getting a little better traction and grip with those rubber soles, then the slide rock may be something you want to stop in at the shop, try on, and just see what the feel and fit is going to be for your particular footbed. Now, from a price point, the slide rocks obviously coming in at a little cheaper price point. These are going to retail at $319.95, while the hard scrabbles are still at $444.95. So if you're looking for a more of a hiker backpacking style boot, not going clearly mountaineering, you know, sheep, goat, really heavy hiking, you know, the hard scrabble is built more for that. You can definitely save a few bucks maybe on your next elk hunt or your out west trip or even just uh, hiking around here back east. These are going to be a great boot for most guys. And I'm sure with Kinetrek's quality and the way they've built boots, uh, they're definitely going to hold up better than just your average boot that you pick up at, at any footwear store. So if you're looking for a brand new pair of these Kinetrek Slide Rocks or any other standard stuff, then certainly jump on mikesarchery.com or give us a call here at the shop and we will get a pair of boots coming your way.